The real reason for tattoos and oats. Genesis 4.15, Cain is, has an oat placed upon him by yod heh Like oat seed that was found on a mountain that walked 5,000 years ago, the oat is a special contract by yod heh that is similar to having a brand for cattle or uploading an operating system to a computer. It makes the one with a cross tattoo in each. Now, Leviticus 19.28 warns us not to put marks on our body. In Leviticus 22.3, the ultimate real reason for tattoos and oats is a special necrot that's found in the Torah nowhere else. The yeast will be cut off from the presence of Yodei Vav Hey. And what the necrot involves is that they're no longer to be in the presence of Yodei Vav Hey. And so if Yodei Vav Hey is in this world, they're not allowed to be of this world. Vanu Sha'al, Yeshua Yakti Shu Eben, Bayad Shalanu, and then say one of these Shamam. And then, Amen va Aman. Now, here's what I recommend. Say, for instance, you got the two people that don't have tattoos, that can actually speak Ivory, that are intelligent, that have an IQ of above 140, that know what the significance of Matthew 18, 16, and Deuteronomy 19, 15, and the contract is, John 14, 13, which you're asking the Shemam of Yeshua Haman Lechiura should be done, and then Exodus 30, having the anointing oil, and then also the special zizi on the four corners, the techelet, the special blue color. You can get all the blue threading you want to try to get that techelet color. It's almost like this color here. So then what you do is you have this stone. So Say you don't even have all that stuff. Say you just have the stone and two people, and you guys don't have a tattoo. You can actually do this. You would say, <coughs> I recommend having the zit zit, the anointing oil, and all this other stuff. But you could say, Lanu Sha'al, Yeshua, Yakdishu, and then you could either say Evan or Eben, because this is normally either a V or a B, but the way it's spelled here is Evan. So, you, Lanu Sha'al, Yeshua, Yakdishu, Evan, Bayad, Shalanu, and then I recommend saying this one first. La Eye Amen V Aman. Now, if you're not 100 percent sure on this, then do it again. Say Lanu Sha'al Yeshua Yakdishu Eben Bayad Shalanu La Eye Amen V Aman. And then your stone should be Yakdishu in a certain Shamam. Or a Shamam that is uh Chacham. Thanks for taking the time to watch. If you have any questions, make sure that you ask Yeshua HaMelech Yoda. And don't ask me because I don't feel like responding to your questions. But you can always send me a donation. I won't deny a donation. You can send me all the money. You'll have, you'll have treasure in heaven if you send me a donation. You'll have treasure in the Shamaims. Thank you for taking the time to like, subscribe, and watch. And go look up Otzi. Go look up Otzi. He should have been called Oat Oz, but his name was Otzi. And you go, you can look him up and see that he had the same tattoo.